whole game, then yeah, you're not going to have a voice come Saturday. Get up, We're on defense now. Let's go D and any other time. Let's go Pirates. Let's go Blue. I used to cheer, so this is pretty normal for me. Let's go Pirates! <laughs> Invariably, my students come in saying, oh, I can't sing today because I screamed at the ball game all weekend. When I used to cheer, it was out good for the weekend at least. Tonight it's going to be pretty scratchy. In the morning, it'll come in and out. Let's go, deep breath! When you take a breath, your ribs expand and they pull the lungs out with them, and then your diaphragm uh, descends, it goes down, so your lungs can't open up. The best way to get a good breath for vocal support is to just let nature take its course. L get out of the way, you keep your chest high so that nature can take its course and your lungs can expand properly. <coughs> Nature's design is for the muscles in your body to pull back up and to pull in when you exhale. So the best thing you can do is just get out of the way. Just push out let nature take its course. This will automatically cause your vocal mechanism to be supported by air. You will not be using the muscles in your throat which will inhibit the movement of your voice. You might want to think of, say, speaking right between your eyebrows all the time. This keeps everything high. It keeps these muscles relaxed. Ah! This is serious whether you're a singer, whether you're a speaker, or if you're a cheerleader, whatever you're doing, if you're a fan, take care of your voice. Let's go, Williams! Okay, David, I know that you know the proper technique for singing and for making a loud noise. What I want you to do is to show all of us the right way to yell and the wrong way to yell. Go, Patriots! Go Patriots! Now, why was that a good thing? The why last time, thing? what did you do the because last time? Because I was supporting my breath from my diaphragm. It came more from inside than from my throat. <laughs> the best thing that you can do is, is to squat just a little bit or bend your knees just a little bit because then any tension that you have here in the sides of your body falls out and the weight of your body falls into your thighs. <laughs>